Well, here we are, ready for round two of That Mystery Box Company. Let's get into it. What's up guys, Jeremy here from Let's Start a Pop Collection coming at you with yet another mystery box opening. Uh, today we have part duh of the um, that mystery box company $40, $35 I think mystery box has four pops in it. Two packs count as two pops. <laughs> I can never get that right. <laughs> anyway, two packs count as two pops so there could be a total of you know, two singles and a two pack or two two packs or you 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 get the idea. Anyway, we've got this uh, this box here. I will go briefly run through real quick what we got in the last one. We got Vanya. Still don't know if I'm saying her name right. As you can see, haven't changed clothes because this I'm filming this literally two minutes after I filmed the last one. Uh, we got Naomi. We got probably my favorite there in that box, Cling. And lastly, we've got what we see a lot of, the Blue Baseball Fury. Fantastic box. I think the value, return value on that was $67 for $40 mystery box. Outstanding. Love it. Love it. Uh, and at least, at least one pop, if not two of them, that'll stay in the collection full time or regular forever, whatever I'm trying to say. Um, okay, so without further ado, what do you say we get into this one? You ready? Last one came shipped really nicely too. The uh, packaging was great. Bubble wrap on everything. Um, bubble wrap on everything and well protected in the box. So. Okay, box is open, step one. Check. Let's go, let's do it. Let's see what we've got. I hate that sound of cardboard on cardboard like that. I may have opened it upside down. There's no end to the bubble wrap, so I'm just gonna tear the bubble wrap on top. I always say save your bubble wrap. Sometimes you gotta Sometimes you gotta tear it. What are you gonna do? Okay, so that's torn. I have, as advertised, four pops. Three of them are not in protectors and one of them are, or one of them is. I'm gonna pull these all out upside down probably like I did the last time. Ready? Here we go. Oh, sweet. I got Quail Dog, Hot Topic exclusive. That's awesome, from Disney, from, from Doug. Uh, yeah, I like that. I actually like that a lot. That's really, that's really cool. I'm going to bring these back here so I can stack these on top and you'll be able to see what we get in this box. All right, so we got Quail Dog from Doug. Very, very cool. This next one feels heavy, not in a protector. Um, let's see what we got. Okay, we got a Lord of the Rings. This is my first Lord of the Rings pop. Saruman? I don't even know. I don't even know. I shouldn't even say it because I'm going to make a fool out of myself. Uh, I have seen a Lord of the Rings movie. I'll give you that. But I don't know what, uh, I don't know what his name is. I'm not going to lie. Condition on these boxes were great in the last one. I don't see anything. There's a little bitty ding right there on the top, little little crease, no big deal. Um, it's heavy, very cool. Okay, next one, not in a protector, is this one. Hey, we got a Pennywise. Pennywise with boat. That's actually perfect because I recently bought my first Pennywise and um, he's back there somewhere. 
but I bought the one with, uh, I can't even remember what it's called, Meltdown, I think it is, and he's kind of face paint is kind of melting, and he's in regular clothes with suspenders, and I really thought, after I got it, I was like, you know, I love that one because it's different. I don't see it all the time, but I really just want one that's the full character Pennywise, so that's really cool. I don't think, you know, they made so many variations of Pennywise. Uh, if they would have done one or two, I would have I would have been all over it. But once they did like 500 versions of Pennywise, eh, you know, I decided I'd get one and not collect all of them. Okay. Uh, for the record, I read the book when I was a kid. It literally traumatized me. <laughs> Uh, the made-for-TV version of it was brutal, um, in my opinion, and I thought both movies were fantastic. Okay, without further ado, we got one last pop. It is in a protector. Also feels heavy. Don't think I got another Warriors, but probably. We'll see. Who knows? Ready? Go. Coco! Look at that. He was one of the top hits. Hector, I don't know if he's one of the top hits, but he was in the, on the uh, he was on the page of what you could expect or what you might be able to pull. So I don't know if he, how much value he has, but that's a really cool one. I just got Miguel with guitar in a mystery box, and I uh, love that pop. That pop's great. So getting to add Hector to him will be really really cool. Who else we got in this line? And Miguel, Hector, and Ernesto. I need to get Ernesto next. We'll complete that. We'll complete that one. So that's what we got, guys. What do you think? What are your, uh, what's your favorite pop? We're going to go over value here real quick, but put down in the comments what your favorite of these four are. I like to pick which one my favorite is before I see value, but uh, you guys will know mine will be the cheapest one. Actually, it won't be because I'm not going to pick this one and I think this one will probably be the least expensive let's play a game of the pop is right or whatever it is I see a couple of people do let's do that I'm gonna say that it is the least expensive uh, this is tough I'm gonna say no yeah I'm, I'm gonna say quail dogs second least and then this guy that I'm not gonna try to pronounce his name and then Hector is the top so Let's see what we got. And I'll go ahead and keep track and give you a value. Let's figure out how I lost my pen. All right, let's do this. We're going to go with Pop Price Guide. I'm really excited I got that Hector. That's really cool. Okay, I got to type in it 472 and see if there's. Okay, there's only four. With boat. Okay, there's that. Yeah, I mean, there's that, and there's a, this one, and there's a chase version. That chase version is pretty cool, but it looks like he's just a different color, really. Anyway, this one is nine dollars. Okay, so far so good. Feeling good. What do I got? Quail dog. Oh, I lost. <laughs> okay, we're going to do that. And Quail Dog is a $7. Next one we have, not going to try to say his name still. And this guy is... This guy here is nine dollars. So right there we have uh, twenty-five of the forty back, uh, with Hector yet to be yet to be uh, priced. So let's see what we got. Hector three oh five. Hector 305. All right, so Hector is $28. Good stuff. 
So we got $53 return on a $40 box. Once again, um, more than our, uh, more than the guaranteed value. That's a win in my book any day. Tell me down below which one is your favorite. I don't know if I just said which one my favorite is, but uh, of course I like Doug. These two are these two are cool, but I will say in this case, Hector's my favorite. That's cool, Pop. That's really cool, and and he's gonna add to the collection that I already have. So pretty stoked about that one. That's pretty good. So that's what we got, guys. Uh, I'd say all in all between the two boxes. Let's see if I can do this. Part one, part two. I call that a win-win. That Mystery Box Company, go check them out. They are on Instagram at That Mystery Box Company. And they are uh, fairly new to the Mystery Boxes, I believe. And they obviously did not disappoint. These are two great boxes, came in over value and... I couldn't say enough good things about them. Um, so go check them out over on Instagram. And, and if you like mystery boxes, i jump all over one next time they drop one. So they're dropping them regularly. I think they just dropped one recently as of the time I recorded this video. But, uh, yeah, I'm sure they'll have many, many more to come. So I look forward to getting another one. Thank you, guys. I appreciate you always tuning in. Thanks for... Um, yeah, thanks for sticking around. Appreciate all the love and support. Guys, uh, if you're out there working in this, I appreciate your willingness to put yourself at risk and um, be out there in it to all the essential workers. I thank you. Um, keep doing what you do. Keep your head up. Hopefully we can all be back together soon. High-fiving and, uh, and uh, spending time together. So... Thanks for watching. I appreciate you guys always tuning in. Take care. We will see you in the next one.